Hello from Taiwan, from very rainy Taiwan, actually. Uh, I'm in Taiwan right now. I'm going to be here for a few weeks, but that doesn't stop me from doing videos. And so here's another video. So I, uh, in fact, you might recognize this exact same location from a video probably of about, I mean, a while ago anyway, over a year ago, I remember recording right here. Anyway, this video is a very short one. I just wanted to say a couple things that have been going on and, uh, and to update you. Uh, first of all, and most of them are dealing with, well, okay, first of all, my course. My course, that there's a link to it in the description below. It uh, is uh, How to Be a Successful Freelance Translator, now has uh, a couple extra lessons, and it also has captions, subtitles, in case that helps. And also what I added, well, let me explain the whole thing, because then I have a new course out as well, called Sales and Marketing for Freelancers. And this is for freelancers of all types. So definitely if you're a freelance translator, but also if you're any other type of freelancer, a freelance designer, freelance programmer, freelance uh, photographer, freelance marketer, freelance researcher, freelance medic or lawyer, I mean, those exist too. And uh, any type of freelancer, um, anyone you know who works themselves, work, works online, stuff like that, this is sales and marketing for you. Uh, the main reason I did this is because I, you know, I had to start figuring all this stuff out by myself because there wasn't any place where I could figure it out. There's plenty of sales and marketing out there, but it's assuming you have a company or sales staff or, you know, a marketing department or something along those lines. Or what they'll do is it'll be program specific. Like it'll be basically to market or to promote a certain program or platform or something like that. Anyway, I just wanted something for all types of freelancers out there, how to deal with sales and marketing. Most of it, obviously, is online, but also stuff offline, which very often gets neglected. And so anyway, there's a new course out there. I'll link to that as well uh, with a discount in the description below. And, um, and so feel free to tell all your freelancer friends, even if they're not translators, about it. And what I also have at the end are coupon codes. Basically, at the end of each course, I have coupon codes for my other courses. Once you do take a course, you get a coupon for both my other courses. I have three courses out, by the way, in case none of this is making sense. I have How to Be a Successful Freelance Translator. I have the Sales and Marketing for Freelancers that just came out. And in the middle, I also have one on how to hire freelancers, which obviously I talk about less in this, um, during these videos, because it has less to do with, uh, with people who are freelance translators. But obviously right now, you know, I started off as a freelance translator. That's how I earned a living. And now I hire freelance translators and work with them for my translation agency. So now I earn a living from hiring freelancers. So I've got, I got to see it from both sides of the coin, if you will. And so that's why I wanted to do this course on how to hire freelancers, you know, so you can keep the freelancer happy, but you can also make sure you earn a living from it. And um, anyway, so I have these courses out coupons for all of them in the description below or if you sign up for one of the courses you get coupons for the other ones and uh, subtitles for all of them I think now um, definitely for the first two anyway by the time this is out there should be subtitles for all of them as well so enjoy hopefully you'll find the, those useful by the way there's another course in the works I've just been going crazy with courses lately anyway the next course I'm I am working on right now is for uh, living remotely and working remotely which is what I've been doing for the past five, six years, along with my wife. As a married couple, we've been doing this. And so I feel like uh, there's a lot of misinformation out there. There's a lot of information that's not out there that you need to know though. Anyway, I've all, I'll obviously let you guys know when it's up and running. And uh, But for now, we have sales and marketing for freelancers. And we have, um, well, how to be a successful freelance translator. That's always up there. And I'll link to the courses on Udemy. They're also up in other platforms, by the way, like Skillshare, and they should be up in some, on some other ones soon. Uh, but for now, I just keep linking to the ones on Udemy because those are usually the standard ones that I have up there. And uh, that's pretty much it for now. I'll see you in the next video. If you like this video, please don't forget to click like because that's how I can keep track of what videos work and which ones don't. And uh, so a like always helps on the videos that you do like. Don't forget to subscribe if you want more videos dealing with freelance translation, freelancing in general, et cetera, et cetera. And I'll see you in the next video. Thanks. Bye.